One of the largest cities in the United States has declared a state of emergency after police clashed with hundreds in protests over the death of an African-American young man while in custody. Baltimore Mayor Stephanie Rollins Blake ordered a nighttime curfew for all city residents from this evening on. In addition, Maryland Governor Larry Hogan imposed a state of emergency and called in 5,000 National Guard troops. In addition, the same number outside police ordered to the area. At least 27 people were arrested as protesters, and many of them high school students clashed with law enforcement as anger over the death of Freddie Gray continues to simmer. The 25-year-old man died from severe spinal injuries sustained after being arrested by Baltimore police. Meanwhile, thousands of mourners and supporters gather at the new Silent Baptist Church to pay respects to young Gray. A banner reading Black Lives Matter and All Lives Matter hung in the church, which uh, was packed with around 3,000 people. Gray's family and their lawyer called for calm amid the growing tensions. However, many also spoke against the negative portrayal of protests against the mass killing. So it's easy for the news to capture young people rioting and looting. It's easy to show that, but you ain't ever gonna say why.